Hi there, I'm Mehdi and in this video I'm going to a quick review of the first wool fabric generator material which you can purchase from all marketplaces such as Artisation, Gumroad and others. This is a base material and you can use it with all substance version. Still I suggest you to use the latest version of it. Maybe I should mention you can use this material in any program which is supported by Substance ecosystem. Now back to Substance. We import this material as base material and now we have it on our shell. Let's use it on our model and yeah, we have it. Let's go and check parameters. Okay, we can switch on or off our Victorian patterns here. Victorian patterns have two different modes, set 1 and set 2. For set 1, it just has one pattern and you can switch between 20 different patterns here as you can see there is an option for tiling pattern between one and three and if you want more tiling option you can use this selection uh, this scale option which can help you to keep your quality of your pattern there is an option for rotation which can choose between 0 or 45 degree but always you can rotate your whole pattern with this rotation option here in UV transformations now we are going to set 2 and set 2 parameters in set 2 parameters there are more options you can tweak first of all you can have two different patterns here as you can see there is two different pattern here you have 20 patterns for pattern 1 and 20 for pattern 2 you should have 400 different results for set 2 there are options for a scale random scale rotation and random rotation for each pattern as you can see i can trick now we are going back to set 1 in general parameters, you can control everything in general. You can control hue, saturation, luminosity, normal mode, wrinkle intensity, as you can see here, normal intensity in general, roughness, metallic, and high range and position. There is a lot of options under pattern category. You can control normal pattern in general mode and individual tweak parameter for each part of pattern we have normal mode two different normal pattern and custom pattern input for all pattern or each part of pattern individually we have intensity option here for normal tiling for normal pattern and if i choose individual we can do all these setting for each part of pattern now we should move to color roughness and metallic for parts of pattern as you can see if i turn this color to r g and b we can control these areas with individual parameters like this i have an option for using texture in my color roughness and metallic for each part of these pattern in the end part of pattern parameters i have border option too background parameters have useful option too I can choose between mode of backgrounds like pattern 1, 2 and custom input. As you can see pattern 1, pattern 2 and custom input. I have tiling option for pattern 1 and 2. You can see here. And there is a normal intensity option for our patterns. There is a normal mode. You can switch between DirectX and OpenGL. And color option for our background. You can use roughness, metallic and serial option for background pattern this is a quick preview of fabric generator and i hope you enjoy it you can write a comment below this video and tell us your opinion it could help us to produce a better tool for you and please 
don't forget to subscribe our channel and hit the like button if you like it.